Afternoon beauties, welcome back to the channel. My name's Tom, thank you for joining me. Where today, a uh, bit of a special day today actually, um, because I'm out testing a possible new bike. A KTM 1290 Super Adventure. Good friend of mine, Martin, uh, local rider, really good rider, motocross biker, has lent me this for the afternoon because he's an absolute legend and uh, wanted me to go and have a play basically and see what I thought because this year I'm hoping will be new bike gear I want to go bigger I want to go better so uh, this is the main contender to be fair but enough chit chat Let's go. Oh, let's just take a minute to uh, listen to this Akrapovic. Oh, God, this thing is nuts. Right. So what I won't be doing is uh, going crazy. But the roads have dried out, so I will be uh, having a bit of fun. And I won't lie, for the entire ride here, I just wanted to have sort of 10 minutes to uh, get accustomed to the bike, see what it was like, how it felt. And, uh, my God. <laughs> All I've done the entire way is giggle, laugh and swear. <laughs> it, honestly, oh, I... This, this, this thing is nuts. It's mental. So this is the 2020 model, so it's not not old old, but you know, she's a couple of years old now. Oh my god, fourth gear is fucking nuts. <laughs> this has got a hundred more horsepower than my Kawasaki, so you can imagine what this is like for me. I like a kid in a fucking candy store right now. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, this is nuts! First impressions of the bike, I mean, I'm guessing whoever watches this is probably an avid KTM rider. It's insane, as far as, that's as, far as I'm going to go. It's just a different kettle of fish. Different kettle of fish to what I'm used to. And I cannot wait <laughs> to invest in something like this. I didn't know. I, I didn't actually know what to expect. In all fairness, you hear, you hear horror stories about KTM. <laughs> so far, horror stories. What? <laughs> oh, I'm not sorry for this thing. Oh my Jesus, wet. <laughs> this, <laughs> I can't stop laughing. <laughs> oh my God. I have to be honest, so far, comfort, this thing's bloody lovely. Seat's not too bad, riding position's pretty good, and Martin's, you know, six foot odd, so he's a hell of a lot taller than me, so he's, you know, longer arms, etc. Riding position's not bad on this, to be fair, for me. If anything, I'd maybe move the bars, like, a touch back my way, but apart from that, it's pretty comfy, leg-wise. I can I can actually touch the floor as well. Bonus. Oh my 
my god, this thing is fucking quick. Oh my god! This thing is an absolute missile! <laughs> Loads of low down grunt, haven't they? <laughs> Let's not do that going up here. Front end to be fucking moving. Ooh, ooh. Stuck behind a bus. Do 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 do. This thing is so quick. Fucking hell! Oh my! <laughs> and breathe, and breathe, and breathe. Fucking Jesus! You hit about 5,000 RPM and the fucking thing just takes off. <laughs> oh my god, I'm relaxed. Cheers, Chief. Thank you. Sounds insane, this bike. That Aquapovic exhaust. Fucking hell. Fourth gear pull, man. Like 35 to 70 in like a second. <laughs> oh my god, this is deadly. Absolutely deadly. Right, ladies and gentlemen, this might get a bit fast. Sam, if you do watch this video, can you help me fuzz this out? <laughs> Fucking hell!
Jesus! Well, I think my mind's already made up, to be honest with you guys. I don't, I don't even think I'm going to make a series out of this. I think I'm just going to buy a KTM. <laughs> I fucking knew this was going to happen. I knew I was going to ride this and that would be it. Oh, not even giving any other bikes a chance. <laughs> well, Mr. Vincent, looks like at some point this year, <laughs> probably sooner other than later, I'm going to be <laughs> joining the KTM family. I'm not, even, I'm not even doing it to be a dick, it just makes you want to go. <laughs> the car in front probably thinks I'm an absolute brick. <laughs> no, he definitely does. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> I can uh, right. Sam, I understand why you giggle so much. This thing is so quick. <laughs> oh, I feel like I'm gonna have a love affair now. Mine's basically said if I want to use this, I can use it. I'm never gonna ride my verses. <laughs> It's done 5,000 miles in the 12 months I've had it. Soon to have 5,000 miles in the next 12 months because I'm just going to be riding this. <laughs> Martin also said if I wanted to take it away on a uh, trip, I'm more than welcome as well. So, it looks like I'm going to be doing a bit of touring on this thing as well, hopefully. <laughs> Honestly, oh, do you know what? I've never had as much fun as I am right now. See, I'm being deadly serious on all the bikes that I've ridden. You know, it's not it's not been many. It's you know a good few, but this this tops it. Everything from the riding position. You know, I love the touring position, so I like the upright riding. I love being able to see all the road. I'm not hunched over. I like how an adventure bike rides but you've got the power of a super bike underneath you so it's like the best of both worlds and it's absolutely nuts I love it I I actually do think this could just be the one and only video for the series oh <laughs> Got to be sensible, there might be horses. <laughs> oh my god. Oh well, we were. It's very agile, this bike, isn't it? You chuck her around. All of the electric gizmos, like the traction control and everything, works really well. I've not felt uneasy on this at all. And I've been a bit of a knob. <laughs> and it hasn't ever felt like it was going to, you know, come unstuck. Oh my god. That, that is addictive. Gear 2 and 3. Given her full tits, that is addictive. And I'm not even riding it like a knob. This is my first time riding one, so I'm not going to be going there. Uh, full tits today. Oh, oh my god! <laughs> Right, 
I'm going to see what this is like on a dual carriageway situation. Third gear. Bloody hell. These things are fierce, aren't they? <laughs> Proper nice at cruising speeds though. Really nice. Cute doggo in the back of the car. We like doggos. Oh, the pop and bang! <laughs> oh, Jesus wept. Well, I am thoroughly enjoying this bike a little bit too much. I think Martin's probably wondering where the hell I've got to. Oh, I must take it back really, haven't I? Um, I'm hoping to bring this bike onto the channel a fair bit before I buy my KTM. If that's the way I'm going to go. I might I might have to test a few others just just to be sure but you never know so yeah big things coming for the channel Jesus Christ I'll leave my Instagram in the description if you want to stay up to date with what I do eventually choose to do before I get into trouble I'm going to end the video here if you've enjoyed it give it a thumbs up if you want to see more of this bike and potentially my next bike whenever that comes soon I'd imagine hit subscribe that would be brilliant and uh, I'll catch you all in the next one keep going you knob